Now, if I am going to use birth control pills, what's my favorite? What would I choose? Well, I would choose, and this is not my first choice for most of my perimenopausal women, but for some. So in that group, I prefer the progestin-only pill that has drosperinone. Drosperinone is a unique progestin that has the most similarity to real progesterone. Now, it's not real progesterone, but when you look at how it binds to receptors, what it does, it has the most similarities. It is not derived from testosterone, which is where most of the other progestins are coming from that are used in birth control pills, 19 nor testosterone. So they have some androgenic effects, which is not what most women want. Most women don't want like testosterone-like effects because they can give you more acne, facial hair. They don't really want that. So when you have the drosperinone, and the brand name for that, it's patented, is called SLYND, S-L-Y-N-D. Now, that is a progestin only. There's no estrogen in it. So this is what I do, and I want you to know that this is my concoction, so to speak. Instead of using the birth control pills, ethanol estradiol, if I use SLYND, I can add bioidentical estradiol to be given transdermally. So at least I'm giving human bioidentical estradiol along with a progestin that is the most similar to real progesterone. And once again, the population of perimenopausal women that I am most likely to use this treatment for would be women who are bleeding way too much, way too often. They're the most challenging to try to control because of their hormonal roller coaster that they're they're on from their aging ovaries.